Hello, this is Varko. We are in Aarhus in Denmark. Let's delve into the city together. Moiskart Museum is a renowned cultural institution located in Aarhus, Denmark. Situated in a scenic setting in the outskirts of the city, the museum focuses on archaeology, anthropology and natural history. Do you know I am on the top of the museum? It creates a public space on the top of the building, as you may see here, that you can walk. Now the grass is yellow, but I am sure in spring period all of this place was green. The museum building, covering an area 16,000 square meters, was designed by Henning Larsen and completed in 2014. It hosts permanent and temporary archaeological exhibitions. The Moesgaard Museum's architectural design stands as a significant example of a contemporary Scandinavian architecture. The building's design seamlessly integrates with the surrounding landscape. The rectangular roof plane appears to emerge from the earth, creating a sense of continuity with the natural environment. The fundamental criteria influencing the building's form and orientation have been sustainability, energy efficiency and maximizing the usability of all spaces created by the structure. The museum's grass-covered sloped roof integrates the building with nature and allows users to benefit from the all spaces created by the structure. The south-facing green roof not only protects the objects displayed indoors from the direct sunlight, but also reduces heat absorption and provides insulation, contributing to sustainability and reducing the building's energy consumption. With different functions in all seasons, the roof transforms into various spaces throughout the year. During the summer period, it serves as spaces for activities like theater plays and a Viking market area. In contrast, during the winter period, it becomes a sled track covered in ice. The interior design of the museum seamlessly integrates with a terraced landscape inspired by archaeological excavations. The museum houses both permanent and temporary exhibitions along with various facilities such as a conference hall, a shop, a restaurant, a cafe, dressing rooms and clock rooms. Materials like bronze, natural oak and wool reminiscent of ancient craftsmanship are used in these spaces. All these details are in harmony with the exhibited objects allowing visitors to immerse themselves in and experience the historical time period they are exploring within the museum. In the interior of the museum, natural toned wood and stone materials are used evoking the archaeological excavation experiences of the Danish lands. The sustainability strategy of the building goes beyond the green roof and also includes optimized daylight usage which reduces the need for artificial lighting and minimizes overall energy consumption. The architectural design of Moeskart Museum skillfully balances functionality, sustainability and aesthetic appeal offering visitors an experience that combines natural landscapes, culture and history in harmony. With this machine, you can focus on the objects. I will show you the real objects. Here we can see very in detail. Actually, the object is directly there. It's a very good idea. There is one more there, and there is the other one is the other side. Put on that one right now. You see, it's focusing on it. And we see all this story about this. Okay, I will see with my eyes right now. Mm. One note, if you'd like to come here from the city center, you should take the public bus number 18. 
Thank you for your watching. If you'd like to see more these kind of videos, please subscribe to the channel. Please do not forget to like the video. See you!